This performance is called The Lessons in Carols, a celebration of the Christmas story. From Christchurch Cathedral in Victoria, you're about to join the Christchurch Cathedral School for the 2015 Christmas concert. My name is James Green, and you're tuned in to Go on Shaw TV. On today's show, you might say she's an ageless wonder. Kevin Chirac finds strength in this story packed with plenty of girl power. Runners with a need for speed will learn about technology that's giving joggers a jolt indeed, and what makes the portrait so timeless and personal. We will attempt to come face to face with the answer. We are loaded up on local, so let's do this. Welcome to Go. Hope you're sitting comfortably because we're going to get cute. We're going to get Christmassy on this episode. Uh, right before Christmas, let's bring you some children. Children singing, children giving you the gift of music. We've got uh, Christchurch Cathedral School, head of school. This is Stuart Hall. Uh, and this is a big hall. It uh, is. At the cathedral here, Christchurch Cathedral. What are we uh, about to uh, let our viewers uh, share with us? Well, it's our annual Christmas pageant or Christmas performance, and this year we've switched it up a little bit. We're usually a lot more theatrical, including dance and that sort of thing. And this year it's our 25th anniversary that uh, the school has been here in Victoria, in downtown Victoria. And so we've arranged uh, a special version of the traditional nine uh, lessons in carols, it's called. And, and this version is six lessons in carols a little more suited for our uh, younger audience. It's a Christian school. Uh, what does that mean? Uh, like, what, what is the school uh, founded on? What are the principles of it? To, to offer an Anglican education to any and all who asked for it in, in Victoria. And so it, it's basic Christian, Christian uh, values. Uh, love, love your neighbor, to, uh, love God, and, um, and live your life accordingly. How many kids in the school? 190 students in the main school and 43 in our junior kindergarten down in Fairfield. And it looks like you've got a lot of people involved in band and music and, and choir. All of our students are involved in choir and, and all of our grades six, sevens and eights are involved in the band, yes. Music is, is uh, so important in our life and kids don't know they can play music until you sit them down and teach them. Um, none of our students can opt out of band from grade six, seven and eight and at first there may be a few reluctant ones to get going and, uh, but once they start, uh, three weeks or six weeks into the program our grade sixes are performing for their parents. And, uh, and then over the next few years, it just develops. Have a little listen to these grade sixes. It's gonna blow you away. I am not good enough even to untie his sandals. He will baptize you with the Holy Spirit and fire. Now, from powerfully projecting children, lifting your spirits, we've got a powerful woman lifting weights. Kevin Chirac with the story. <laughs> 